Hello everyone, this is Jiamin Zhang from the University of Tokyo. I will present our study, Spatial Labeling, Leveraging Spatial Layout for Improving Label Quality in Non-Expert Image Annotation. Manual image labeling is necessary for machine learning. However, it is a labor intensive process. Not all one recruit non-expert annotators to do it. Image labeling by non-expert can be very difficult, such as selecting a dog breed label to a dog image and it may contain many errors because non-expert has insufficient domain knowledge. In this study, our goal is to reduce errorance in image labeling by non-experts. We decide an image labeling interface. We call it spatial labeling. In this interface, we propose to leverage spatial layout as a temporary working space during annotation. This is our proposed interface. The center is the image needs to be labeled and the two sides are labels. User needs to select an appropriate label from the two side label list to the image. Now I will show you a demo video. In this interface, an open space is provided. User first spatially lays out images and the labels on the open space, placing related items together. It serves as a working space for tentative labeling. During this process, the user can build domain knowledge by observing similarity and the differences among the items. After laying out the images and the labels, the user gives definitive labels to the images based on the result of spatial layout by drag and dropping one or more images to a label. We expect this process reduce error in image labeling by non-experts. We run a user study to compare a traditional non-spatial layout and our proposed spatial layout interface in an image labeling task. The labeling task is to label 50 dog images by selecting an appropriate labels from a 20 dog breed list. The left video shows how did the user work by the traditional labeling interface. And the right video shows how did the user work by our proposed interface. In the traditional interface, user needs to go to all the labels and try to find the best possible label to the image. However, in our spatial layout interface, users are allowed to organize concepts of labels and the images on the open space before selecting a label for an image. We measure the time and the error rate of the labeling task completed by the participants. The result showed that the task completion time difference was not significant between the non-spatial layout and the spatial layout labeling interface. However, the error rate in the spatial layout labeling task was significantly lower than the non-spatial layout labeling task. The main contribution from this study is that our spatial layout interface can reduce errorance in non-expert image annotation. We believe that this has presented significant insights for manual image annotation. It is because our proposed method can get better results only by tweaking user interface without increasing cost. Please read our paper for more details. Thank you.